Dr. Schwartz and here we're starting seeds because what companies don't want you to know is that your food is killing you. Processed food is giving you cancer. Right, Mugi? He's like, I'm not, I don't care. I'm not in this video. This is the green heated greenhouse kit. And it has a heating element and it's got the seeds uh, thingies and then a tray and then a moisture cover thing. For seeds to germinate, they need to be hot. And so we have put them in this, this device that plugs into the wall. We're gonna start 12 of these. I'm gonna dump these out. Okay, and then I'm going to put another one in there, right? Did I put another one in there? Okay, it's making holes in the dirt for the seeds to go in. What kind of soil is this? Organic potting soil. Organic potting soil. So we didn't do the three parts vermiculite to peat moss, blah, blah, blah. We just got some organic potting soil or whatever. We've been taking the tweezers and putting two to three seeds into the hole. What are you planting right now? Habaneros. Habaneros. We just put pepperoncinis in. Yes. Yes? Are you cute? Yes. Yes. <laughs> okay. We still have to get lights for this, right? We're going to get lights and we've got a timer that we're going to set up and have the lights come on during the day or during the night. We haven't quite figured that out yet. It's exciting. We're growing our own seeds. It's exciting to think that we're starting the lives of these plants and we'll have more than enough food to juice and to eat and all that. We got this moisture thing on and we're supposed to keep it on there until the plants are an inch tall and then we take off the moisture cover and then we're supposed to be able to put these in bigger pots. That's going to be its own trial on its own. Once we get to that point, we'll have to transplant them into bigger things and that plantable little potting vessels. Wait till they grow to the point where we can put them in the ground and it's nice out. It's still pretty cold and snowy out, so got a ways to go.